Who is this for? This webinar is best suited to help people who don't have control over how many people visit their website, how many leads they get, how many customers they get. So right now they're getting customers, but it's definitely not with consistency. They've done well, but they want to go beyond well, beyond their current plateau, and they want to do it consistently, automatically, and quickly. They're not quite there yet, and the lack of revenue is holding them back from doing the stuff they want to do. Imagine you could spend as little as 30 minutes a day on your Google Ads, knowing that at the end of each month, you could see more sales, and you knew what to do next month to see even more. And imagine how less stressed you'd be when every time you went into Google Ads, you saw your costs going down and your sales going up. I'm going to show you how you can turn that wonderful dream into a reality. I'm going to show you how to reclaim tens of thousands of pounds a year in lost revenue, how to improve both volume and quality of your leads, increase the revenue without actually increasing your ad spend, and finally, how to earn an extra 50 to 100% a month in revenue. Does this sound like you? You're fed up of spending so much time trying to make this work. You spend hours tweaking your ads and swapping out keywords, hoping you're going to hit that magical formula that's going to get people buying. Or maybe you're starting to wonder if Google Ads really is the best way for you to market your business. Maybe you're thinking it's time to give up and try something new. Does that sound like you? Let me know in the chat if it is, if you're having these kind of challenges. Maybe you don't have a good handle on how Google AdWords actually works. You have a disorganized AdWords account. You maybe have lots of ads and lots of campaigns and lots of keywords and you go in there every day and you see all this and you're thinking, oh, how am I gonna change all this? How am I gonna improve all this? There's just so much here. And maybe you're getting irrelevant clicks that don't matter to you. You're not seeing improvement in your lead quality or your flow. You see your spend increasing without the results to match that spend. You're spending hours reading blogs and watching tutorials to figure out how you can turn this thing around, but with no luck. Maybe you find it complicated and expensive. Maybe you've decided it's just too time consuming. But here's the good news. If any of this sounds familiar, what you have to realize is that none of these things are the real problem. The real problem is that you're stuck in the old method yet haven't upgraded to the new method, the four principles of which I'm going to share with you today. But more on those four principles in just a second. Hi, my name is Kevin Gallagher, and for the longest time, I struggled to make market, my marketing business work. I had no predictable way of telling where my next sale was coming from. Some months I'd be up, but others I'd be down. Then I discovered the power of Google Ads, and I was really excited. But at first, I lost thousands of pounds and I just did not make any money. But then I discovered these four principles, these four shifts. It changed my business. And now I help other business owners avoid these pitfalls and create scalable, profitable Google ads. You're stuck in the old way. The old way is a bit like a roulette wheel. You put your money on the table and you bet on where the ball's going to land, what color or what number, not knowing if you're actually going to get any money back or you're going to lose it all. And that's the way it feels sometimes. And that's no way to grow your, your business. You know, you go out finding keywords, you create your ads, you spend hours changing those ads, you spend hours changing the keywords because they're not working. So you increase your budget to see if that will help, but it doesn't. So you have to then decrease your budget because you're spending too much money. You're deleting keywords because they're just not doing anything. You're deleting ads because they're not working. Welcome to the new, better, more profitable way. These four principles, what I call the success GPS, strategic ad deployment, customer journey optimization, and rapid revenue scaling. What this allows you to do is reclaim tens of thousands of pounds in revenue to improve the quality and volume of leads, increase your revenue by 50 to 100%, all without increasing your ad spend. So first let's talk about the success GPS. It's a hard fact that businesses are losing out on tens of thousands of pounds a year because they simply don't have their success GPS configured. This is stopping them from generating the revenue they need to grow their business. 
Like with any GPS device, you need to know where you're going. What are you trying to achieve with your ads? Who are you trying to reach? And what is the outcome you seek? You need to build a process to get you there. You need to identify where you want to go. If you were to tell Siri, take me somewhere fun, it wouldn't be able to take you anywhere as you haven't given it any directions or clarity. If you treated your business this way, you'll get lost and waste lots of money. So you have to start with your success GPS. Know the destination before you choose the path to get there. You're taking action, which is good, but you don't know how or why you're doing it. And the result of that, you're just throwing time and money at the problem. Strategic ad deployment. Most Google ad campaigns are destined to fail before they even start. And what ends up happening is your budget is way higher than it needs to be. You pay more for every single click and you're paying for irrelevant clicks. Your cost to get a customer is barely breaking even sometimes. You need to do your research before you spend a penny in ad spend. You need to be strategic about who you're trying to reach and how to get in front of them. And you need to be able to calculate your ROI. If you do all this work up front, you'll maximize the gains from your ad spend. The problem with most ad agencies is that they tell you to spend a certain amount of money and then turn the traffic on. But you don't know if it's good traffic or not. It's even your ideal customer. And is it the right message? And are you framing your offer or your product or service correctly? You need to stop tracking what doesn't matter. 42% of the time, people either don't track their Google AdWords or they're tracking the wrong thing. If you're not strategic about what you track, you won't even know what matters. Here is why tracking conversions should not be your main focus. Conversions are lag indicators and are a result of other factors, or what I call lead indicators. So you need to understand the lead indicators. When you make the switch to strategic ad deployment, you'll understand what you should be tracking. Your ad spend and cost per clicks go down, your traffic and conversions skyrocket, and revenue is created. You're not mining for the gold. What does that mean? Well, let me explain. We all love to select keywords, I know I do, and even get a bit excited about it. But that can quickly turn to disappointment when you realize that the keywords you thought were going to make you a fortune just perform poorly. But with strategic ad deployment, you can understand what search terms are actually bringing you the gold, i.e. revenue, and the ones that are causing you to just throw money down the drain. Meaning every penny you spend will be on the traffic most likely to turn into sales. 90% of Google ad campaigns send their traffic to the wrong place. Jeez, that means a, a lot of unhappy customers. But with strategic ad deployment, you know where you should be sending them and how to give them the best experience when they get there. Here's what happens. Your conversions go up and your cost of acquiring a customer goes down. Customer journey optimization. The beauty of customer journey optimization is that you will pay the same in ad spend, but get more customers completing the journey, which means you can increase your revenue without increasing your ad spend. Take a look at this example here. We've got three months of optimization. Um, campaign budget is the same every month, 5,000 pounds. Cost per click is the same, a pound. And the amount of traffic and uh, visitors they get is the same as 4,000. But by increasing conversion rate or improving the customer journey, by 2.75%, on month two, month two, you get an extra 10 customers. And if you increase that to 3%, you'll get an extra 120 customers, which are a total of 120 customers. So that's an extra 20 customers a month without spending any more money. Not only this, your cost per acquiring a customer goes down to £45.50 and also with 3%, £41.67. So if you can imagine just that in three short months, imagine what you could achieve in a year. At the moment, you're not thinking about the whole journey. You're just thinking about the ad itself. And that is what is costing you lots of money. And your return on ad spend is so low. 
because you're not focused on the client journey, but when you do, you realize it's not just the ad, it's everything your customer touches. By understanding this journey, you can then optimize it so more people complete that journey, which in turn turns into more sales for you. You need to be thinking about your ad. Is the content of the ad, is the text of the ad hitting your customer's pain points? Is it making them want to click? Is it, does it focus on their challenges and their pains and their desires? Is the landing page experience what they expect when they get there? Are you giving them the information they need to make a purchase? And the path the customer takes to that purchase, is it full of, is it full of roadblocks? If it is, then you need to make sure you get rid of those roadblocks. Take a look at this picture here. This is a funnel of a e-commerce site and you can see the product page, the cart page, the checkout page and the order confirmation page. This is the customer's journey from a product page to becoming a customer. And you can see the conversion rate is 1.7. But you can also see on the product, pa product page and the cart page, there is massive drop-offs. So we can identify this is where we need to focus on improving the customer's journey's ex customer's experience because we can see this is where they're leaving the site the most. But if you didn't have this set up, you would never know that this is where your problem was and you'd never be able to increase your conversion rate and in bottom line, increase your revenue. If you do what you've always done, you'll always get what you've always gotten. Tony Robinson's, Robbins said that. Um, if we didn't change and adapt and, and, and test things, we'd all still be driving a Model T Ford. And finally, I want to talk to you about rapid revenue scaling, where you could add an extra 50 to 100% increase in revenue. Now, I need you to understand, that's not an extra 50 to 100% increase in revenue what you're getting just now. That would be an extra 50 to 100% on top of if you follow the steps I've just talked about. So you can see this is a massive increase. Rapid revenue scaling helps you add in an extra 50 to 100% revenue so you can grow your team, get paid more, get more help so you don't have to spend so much time running your business. Instead, you'll have the revenue to allow you to focus on your business growth. It's not just about getting leads. It's about adding actual revenue to your bottom line. If you're not focused on rapid revenue scaling, then it takes a while for it to iterate the tests and you're just leaving money on the table. Once you have it all dialed in and you've tested what works, you have your customer journey mapped out and optimized, it's now time for rapid revenue scaling. You can change your keyword match types, because maybe you're just using a uh, phrase and um, exact match, expand it to broad match maybe, that'll get you more traffic and you can analyze that and you can get more sales from it. You can introduce new keywords to get more traffic, to new traffic, sorry, and increase it that way. You can retarget people who visited your website who didn't buy and then bring them back to then purchase. You can use Gmail ads as you've got everything figured out. You can use Gmail ads again to try to target more people and get more people to your website and convert. You can use YouTube ads to drive traffic that way with video. You can create mobile only ad campaigns that just focus on people on mobile devices. And the biggest one of all, the Google Display Network with over 2 million websites. Once you've got your, your rapid, rapid revenue scaling in place, when you go to this network, you're going to convert so much more traffic and that is such a big one going to the display network because it's such a big network. But, you know, don't just take my word for it. Here's one of my clients and here's what he said. We've now get more than double the amount of work and over double the amount of leads we had this time last year. What we have now is almost like a rolling juggernaut in that every single day we know that leads are coming in. Every single day there's people visiting our website looking for what we're offering. And here's the proof. After just one month of optimization of following the four principles, he took his leads from 16 a month to 44, which is an increase of massively of 175%. Well, that's all I have. I have explained the four principles and how you can generate a lot more revenue from your Google Ads. And my goal for today has been to demonstrate that there's a path to profitable Google Ads. And I think you'll agree. Pop it in the chat if you agree that I have accomplished that. What we talked about today was how you're leaving tens of thousands of pounds a year on the table because you do not have your success GPS configured correctly. We also talked about strategic ad deployment. 
why you're paying more than you need to acquire every customer, and in some cases, just breaking even. We talked about customer journey optimization and how you can create more revenue without increasing ad spend. And finally, we talked about rapid revenue scaling and how it can add an extra 50 to 100% in your revenue so you can get paid more, plus you can get more help and enough revenue to grow your business.